Dozens of students and parents back in Lawton tonight after their bus carrying them to an archery competition in Kentucky caught fire early this morning on the Creek Turnpike. Two News reporter Brandon Richards spoke to one of the students on board that bus. Brandon. Students, parents and teachers boarded a bus for Lawton going back home without a trophy from a national competition which they never made it to. Also going home without any of their equipment. When Jenny McKeon decided to accompany her daughter Tiffany to a national archery competition, neither one expected to be heading home so soon. And it's not because Tiffany was off her mark, but because of this. I thought we had blew a tire, but it may have been something else. Whatever it was, it caused a charter bus carrying Tiffany's team to catch fire Thursday morning outside Catoosa. As the flames intensified, the adults knew they needed to act fast. Most of the kids were sleeping, so we were waking them up. You know, get up, get up, the bus is on fire. The children, barely awake, tried to make sense of it all. I was crying. I was like, what's happening? Our bus is on fire. The adults able to get everyone off the bus, but some things couldn't be saved. We lost, like, <laughs> our suitcases, our bows. Which means no trip to nationals, not this year. The only trip they'll take today, the long trip back home. Now the students tell me they're disappointed, but do plan to try again next year. Investigators still trying to determine the cause of the fire. Reporting near Catoosa, Brandon Richards, 2 News works for you. Silver lining there is everybody got out safe. That is Absolutely. the good news. Well,